This my intro, no need for an introduction. My EP flow to the beat like a percussion. My name is T. Stand for E. Tizzle with that lyrical potential, destroying these instrumentals. I really just pride myself on trying to make music that can drive a positive change in somebody's life. God is my driving force. I put the pedal to the metal. Speed. I'm from the area from Kansas City, Kansas. Uh, started out going to Hazel Grove. So I play a role in recruiting the uh, classified and certified staff with the school districts. Thank God for my life. Yes, I'm blessed. I started making music when I was a uh, teenager. I attended Faith Deliverance Family Worship Center, my church, and then what I used to do was actually uh, remix songs with my sister, and then we would perform them for our youth group at church. On the beats. Being able to create music in a creative way, you know, that's like the platform and the canvas that I have to be able to try to drive change. You gotta stay poised like a QB in a pocket void and the pressure. Step up to the challenge and be the aggressor. After attending F.L. Schlegel, I actually played football at the University of Kansas, too. So I've uh, won two bowl games there. And I like to make a lot of music for, you know, student athletes to stay focused. I make a lot of, like, pumped up songs because they're like, man, it gets me in the right mindset. It wasn't me. I actually had a music video called It Wasn't Me featured on MTV back in May. And I would have never thought that would have happened, but I posted it to Instagram and the MTV TV director seen it. And that just kind of shows me as, you know, whatever I put out, I just want to try to reach as many people as possible. I just want to leave a legacy for my son and my daughter. And my latest song, uh, Leave a Legacy, is really a message to my kids to really honor them. I want to give them the message of hard work, perseverance, and dedication. I want that to kind of be a reference point of the love that I try to translate to them. I've gotten hundreds of messages after releasing that music video simply because it kind of struck a chord with a lot of um, parents out there. That just lets me know that I'm creating the, the music the right way instead of creating music that can tear down someone, I'm creating music that can build somebody up.